heading to Reunion tomorrow. Uh, we're just doing final jobs on the boat, engine checks, and bits and pieces, some rigging checks, and all, the, all that sort of stuff, which we've been doing yesterday and again uh, today. And I'm going to turn around here so you can see the fleet. I will take some other shots of the whole fleet. All looking extremely beautiful and gorgeous as always. They keep these boats so immaculate. Uh, it really is incredible. Uh, weather here is good. A little bit of wind today. There was no wind yesterday. guys it is Wednesday morning time for departure uh, to Reunion Island uh, from Port Louis in uh, Mauritius we're just waiting to get checked out and uh, it's about 120 miles nautical miles so what we're going to do is we're going to leave at around four o'clock in the afternoon uh, we're going to have an, an overnight passage of about 15 12 to 15 knots of uh, wind behind us and then hopefully we will arrive sort of early morning. Uh, it's a little harbor, a bit like this, oh, well, obviously a bit smaller, I guess. Uh, no anchoring, uh, they're very restricted. Restrictive there, um, environmental reasons and coral protection, I guess, I suppose, uh, rightly so. So we're all gonna be in a similar sort of position to this in Reunion. And I think there's quite a few boats from the Oyster Rally uh, coming uh, today as well, and then some will follow on in the next couple of days. Um, a glorious day, nice and warm, boats all ready, uh, we've wiped her down, washed her down, there's going to be a little bit of sailing but I think it might be a bit of motor sailing, um, we've done all our final checks, we have to put her, replace our, our lowers which we brought over from Dublin which was, uh, you know, it's always a bit of a, a bit of a panic when you know you're replacing rigging uh, and to make sure the size is correct and so on but luckily it is. So. Uh, Hopefully now the rigging will be absolutely fine. Uh, the, the jury rig the lads had on it uh, seemed to work well for the last passage uh, from Coca Keeling uh, Islands. Um, but uh, we're all systems go here, and everyone seems to be just nice and relaxed. The weather's good. It's getting quite warm. Not as warm as French Polynesia, but it's warm enough for me anyway. Um, so hopefully we're going to bring you along for the ride I'm using this uh, Insta 360 camera uh, for this this adventure. So we've got a three meter pole, so we're gonna throw that out the stern and hopefully we get some nice shots along the way. And um, yeah, hopefully we'll see some wildlife as well. Love to see some whales um, and maybe some bird life as well, but uh, hard to know. So there's going to be, I think, uh, two, there's gonna be three, five of us uh, going across and uh, it'll be a sort of a pleasant uh, reunion. I think we're gonna stay there for about five days. Uh, lots of sharks, so I'm not too sure about swimming. And uh, so it's probably going to be a bit of hill walking and stuff like that. Uh, but I'm sure there'll be plenty to do. It's, it sounds lovely. So uh, I'll sign back when we're about to uh, depart. It will be in a couple of hours. Okay.
2am uh, we've got about 17 knots of wind uh, about 130 degrees wind angle which is really nice pleasant sailing, lovely and warm on our way to Reunion Island um, I haven't really used the camera at night time so I'm just using a bit of infrared lights but I'm not too sure whether, whether you'll actually uh, see much I can't really show you the full moon, it looks glorious uh, the camera doesn't really pick it up I've uh, seen a couple of cruise ships uh, one big one, Europa uh, 2 and uh, a couple of oysters still uh, one on our hip and one in front of us but uh, other than that, lovely evening sailing and we should be in tomorrow uh, mid-morning so check in later